Hey guys, I'm going to do a review today of stuff in my hand. You probably just saw where I lived. Hey guys, today I'm doing something I've never done before in my life, and that is a review of a product which I have here. Before any of you start going crazy, no, this is not a paid product placement. I was just curious and I wanted to make a video reviewing 5-4 Clothing. It's one of those subscription services where you pay them and they send you stuff. So I was like, sure, I'll pay you to send me stuff. So usually you get like a pair of pants and a shirt for 60 bucks. I used a coupon code that got me my first month $15 off and they're supposed to send you like an extra item or something. We'll see if that happened. I felt the package. It just feels like a shirt and a pant. A pant? A pair of pants? Whatever. I'm a little nervous. I'm really picky about my clothes. <sighs> so let's open this sucker. Let's see what's inside. It's empty. Just kidding, it's right here. It's wrapped in tissue paper. I thought it was gonna come in a cute box, but it just came in that bubble wrap. You can see the logo there. I'm sure you've seen it all over Facebook and stuff, because that's where they like to advertise. What is this? Something that I don't care about. I just don't care about it. What the hell? What did that hit? We got a graphic tee, graphic tee, and a cardigan. No pants. I thought I had pants. I thought that was supposed to be pants. One t-shirt was 38, the other one was 32, and the cardigan was 60. Who would pay $60 for a cardigan? That's beyond me. First thing, oh, it's the cardigan. Oh, and it has their logo on it. That's okay. It's cute. We'll do a fashion show later and I can try this stuff on. Next thing is a t-shirt. It's supposed to be a small, but it looks like an extra large. I was under the impression that they sent you button downs, and that's what I was looking for. Instead I got this. We'll see what happens next. And this one also looks huge and it's, ew. It's long sleeve, it's a long sleeve t-shirt. And it's just, it's just gray. It's just a gray t-shirt. Who would pay $38 for a plain gray t-shirt? That's, that's my question. That's, I don't know. Who would do that? So far not too impressed with the clothes. I guess that's what happens when you, have someone send you random clothing items. And to cancel, I know you have to go and you have to um, email them to cancel it, but you can only do it at certain points of the year. Shipping, I ordered it last month, like mid-October, and I just got it now, um, which is understandable because I think they only send out the items the first or the 15th of the month. Uh, but once it shipped out, it got here really fast. It was like two day shipping or three day shipping. So I mean, that's cool, um, but the items, now let's do a fashion show and see if these t-shirts are actually smalls or if they're like extra large smalls. Don't mind my mess of a bed. Mess of a bedroom. Plain gray long sleeve shirt. It says it's small, but I'm convinced that it's actually the size of a circus tent. Not too impressed with its existence, but it fits nice. Now for this shirt, which I find extraordinarily ugly and extraordinarily tacky and tasteless. I feel like Zac Efron with this on. Wildcats, go! I usually wear like a medium. This is like a medium large. This t-shirt does not fit my buddies. So far not hating the cardigan. Okay, so the cardigan I don't find terrible. That's actually kind of cute. So far one thing I've noticed is their sizing seems to be very inconsistent. The cardigan on me is actually quite short. It's a small. Their small t-shirt is actually quite long. And then this, it just fits perfectly. So I'm like fucking Goldilocks. Another bad thing about this subscription, and I'm sure this goes for many subscriptions, is that you cannot return anything if you absolutely abhor it, like I do this t-shirt. They'll exchange for sizes no problemo, but as far as returning something that you cannot stand, like I cannot stand my one grandmother, you can't return it. But I guess it makes sense, because I can't return her either. Now as far as the choices that I chose when signing up for 5-4, um, let's take to the computer and find out. I think I chose to have a mix of both kinds of like casual and dress. 
I could possibly be wrong, but I'm never wrong. It's loading. Yeah, I chose for them to send me a mix of different styles. I had pop of color selected for the kinds of colors I like, and it seems as though their idea of a pop of color is gray, navy blue, and white. I would say that's more monotone or neutral, but that's just me. Who was wrong about getting pants with every package, but you know, it's cool. So my conclusion is, though it's fun to receive random things at your doorstep, just like you can either get a Girl Scout who's gonna give you free Girl Scout cookies, you can also get a Girl Scout who's gonna charge you for them that also might be your serial killer. So you never know what you're gonna get. You think for some place that you're gonna pay them for have their stylists pick out something for you. They do more than a plain t-shirt, a cheesy old navy style t-shirt, and they're super cute cardigan. I actually like the cardigan. So I mean overall I give them, yeah, two out of five cats, because they are not the cat's meow. They're like the cat's shit. Sorry, 5-4. As you can tell, I was not paid to make this review. Well, I hope you found it helpful, or at least slightly amusing. Especially if you're a girl, because a lot, most of my people that watch me are girls and they don't really care about this and I'm sorry. So let me know in the comments below, would you subscribe to 5-4 or any of the clothing or monthly subscription services like that? Are there any you think I should try out that I might like? Leave those suggestions in the comments below. Um, other than that, I will see you guys soon, where hopefully I am not making a video where I just open packages with plain t-shirts. Bye.